Good morning, friends. Greetings and welcome to The Bright Side, your nutritional program dedicated to the understanding of the vast world of nutrition and nutritional supplementation. I am your host, Pharmacist Ben, nutritional pharmacist from Boulder, Colorado, registered pharmacist number 12275. I specialize in using nutritional supplements where other healthcare practitioners use toxic pharmaceutical drugs and sometimes deadly medical procedures. If you suspect that there are natural nutritional roads to your vitality and health and well-being and to addressing your health challenges, whatever they may be, but you don't know where to begin, you have come to the right place. As you listen to The Bright Side every day, you are more and more knowledgeable. You are more and more in control of your body, and you know you can overcome any health issue. That's why we're here every day on The Bright Side, helping clear up the sometimes confusing world of nutrition and nutritional supplementation. Over the last 29 years of practicing pharmacy, I have seen drug-free recoveries from diabetes and hypertension and obesity, skin diseases, psoriasis, eczema, rosacea, acne, digestive ailments, autoimmune issues of all kinds, recoveries that by the standards of modern medicine can only be called a miracle, but what is in the world of the body, what is in the world of biology, standard operating procedure, because the human biological system is a healing system. It's a regenerating system. It is designed divinely to heal and renew itself on a moment-to-moment -moment basis, and while some folks may call that healing, renewing, regenerating system a miracle, it really is just the way the body works. If you have questions about health or nutrition or prescription drugs, we want to hear from you. We welcome your calls on the bright side at 844-236-6010. If you have questions about prescription drugs or nutritional supplements, if you want to wean yourself off your meds and get on a good nutritional supplement program, we can help you do that. 844-236-6010 is our number. And of course, if you want to share a success story or just contribute to the conversation, 844-236-6010 is our phone number today and every day on the bright side. If you're interested in purchasing any of the longevity products you heard about or you heard it on the program or heard advertised on the program or recommended on the program, we can help you do that. Call uh, the phone team at 866-735-2470, 866-735-2470. You can also head over to my blog, pharmacistben.com or criticalhealthnews.com and or order products right off the website. You can also sign up to join the Brightside Ben team right off the websites, criticalhealthnews.com, pharmacistben.com, and of course, brightsideben.com. You can also call the phone team at 866-735-2470. 866-735-2470. And if you're interested in purchasing any of our Truth Treatment products, including our 5% retinol gel, no preservatives, no fragrances, no emulsifiers, no surfactants, just active and functional ingredients. All my Truth products are active and functional only. You shouldn't have to pay for wax, folks. You shouldn't have to pay for fillers. You shouldn't have to pay for emulsifiers. You shouldn't have to pay for surface active agents and preservatives and fragrances and water and all the other stuff that you pay for when you buy a skincare product. That's the whole point of the truth. That's why I call it the truth, because the truth is you don't need all that stuff. And the truth is you shouldn't be paying for all that stuff. You can check out all my Truth Treatment products at truthtreatments.com, truthtreatments.com. All right. Welcome back to The Bright Side. We're talking about the glands, the hormone centers, and the chakras as they relate to the chakras. Don't want to get too airy-fairy or too spiritual on The Bright Side. But uh, it's, hard to, it's hard to avoid it sometimes when we're talking about health. The chakras are the ancient, or the term that the ancient, uh, ancient practitioners of what we call Eastern medicine used to call the horm hormone centers. They didn't know about hormones 4,000, 3,000, 5,000 years ago. They didn't know about glands 5,000 years ago. But they sure knew that there was something going on in terms of the centers of the body. They called them chakras, which means wheels. And that refers to the fact that the ancient folks perce perceived these centers as vortexes of energy, circulating vortexes of energy. Hence the name chakra or wheel. The first wheel, the first chakra, the first hormone center is associated with the survival response, the stress response, and that's the one we're talking about. That's the adrenal glands, the fight or flight gland, the fight or flight chakra. It keeps us alive in emergency situations. Got a lot of problems in our culture that are associated with this center this stress center, the survival center, which is associated with fight or flight. We'll be talking about that here in a minute. Second chakra, second hormone center, is the reproductive center. Your ovaries, testes, the gonads. These are associated with harmony, with family, with birthing and creativity, creativity of, uh, with life creativity. 
giving and receiving are associated with this chakra or this hormone center. And of course we know that we've got large issues with ovarian cancers and reproductive diseases and prostate diseases in this center. We've got lots of second chakra health issues in our culture. Likewise, the third chakra, which is the digestive system chakra. That's our power chakra. That's associated with independence, self-control, personal authority. The third chakra is our personal authority chakra, the third hormone center, the solar plexus. This is where we're, we become grounded in the world, centered in the world. It's truly the center of our body. Fourth chakra is our heart chakra, and again, we got problems here too. Heart disease is the leading cause of death in this country and around the world. Not surprisingly, when you consider that this heart center is associated with group consciousness, with understanding, with unity, with harmony. The, the, the uh, fifth sh uh, chakra, also immunity, by the way, is located in the fourth chakra, which is ruled by the thymus gland. The fifth chakra is your thyroid. That's the power of creativity. We also got lots of problems here, too. We got a lot of problems everywhere, but the, the thyroid is uh, the thyroid's associated with the fifth chakra, your throat chakra, they call it. It's associated with expression and the power of the spoken word. Also, breathing is regulated here at the thyroid level between the thyroid level, the fifth chakra, and the fourth chakra, which, which rules the lungs. Then you have the sixth chakra, which is your, Descartes called it the seat of the soul, along with the pineal gland, which is the seventh chakra. These are your ruler chakras. The sixth chakra is your third eye chakra, and the seventh is your crown chakra. That's your pituitary gland and your pineal gland. Love this pineal gland stuff. We talked a little bit about how the church and, and religious organizations and spiritual organizations and occult organizations have always worshipped the pine cone and the pineal gland, which is where something called DMT, dimethyltryptamine, <clears throat> excuse me, is made. A powerful, powerful, powerful hormone-like substance that's been called the spirit molecule by Dr. Rick Strassman. He wrote a book called The Spirit Molecule, talking about DMT. I'm not going to get too much into that, but I'm telling you, if you want to you read a cool book, that's one cool book all about DMT. Melatonin and serotonin are also made in the pineal gland. For now, I want to talk about the adrenal glands, the first chakra, and the survival chakra, the fight or flight chakra. The skin and the adrenal glands have a very important relationship. Adrenal health issues are always going to show up on the skin, and many skin problems are linked to survival, to stress, and this makes sense because the skin is a protective structure. It's a defensive structure. So of course there's going to be a relationship between protection and defense and survival and the skin. Later on we're going to talk about the other glands sh slash chakras and how they relate to hormone secretions in the skin. But for now, let's talk about the adrenal glands because there's so much to talk about when it comes to adrenal health and skin health. Adrenal hormones come in two varieties, two major classes. You've got stress hormones that are made out of the adrenal glands, survival hormones, and then you have what are called somewhat inexactly the sex hormones. They're not really sex hormones, although we call them that. I call them our youth and vitality hormones because they are associated with reproduction. They are associated with sex in that way. They're associated with making babies, but they're also associated with growth and repair and anti-aging, especially when it comes to having beautiful skin especially when it comes to having healthy skin, attractive skin, glowing skin, clear skin, youthful skin, our so-called sex hormones, testosterone, estrogen, DHEA, progesterone, especially progesterone, pregnenolone. These are our youth and fertility hormones, and they are incredibly important for having beautiful skin. If you've got a, a hormone problem at the adrenal gland level, you can use all the darn wrinkle cream you want, and you're still going to get wrinkles. You can use all the skin lightening cream you want, and you're going to still have uh, dark spots. You can use all the acne, and, uh, acne products and oily skin products, and you're still going to have zits and oily skin. The adrenal glands and understanding the adrenal glands and working with the adrenal glands is incredibly important for having beautiful skin at any age. This link between the skin and the adrenals is super fascinating. Even though we've talked a lot, we've spent a lot of time talking about adrenal health and the stress response as it regards heart disease, as it regards immunity, problems with the immune system, problems with the digestive system, problems with the thyroid. But I, in my opinion, this link between beauty and the adrenals, adrenal glands should not be underestimated. I've been in the skincare business for over 32 years, and in my opinion, the best wrinkle cream there is, is working on your adrenal glands. All right, I'm Pharmacist Ben. You're listening to The Bright Side. Our number is 844-236-6010, 844-236-6010. We'll be back right after this. Welcome back 
to The Bright Side. I am pharmacist Ben. Thanks for joining us. We're on the air Monday through Friday, 8 to 9 Pacific and 10 to 11 Central Time, 24-7 on the archive pages at brightsideben.com and uh, brightsideben.com. Uh, BenFuchsArchives.com and BrightsideBen.com. We got archives up and search engines up on both of those websites. We can also, uh, you can also order products off our blogs, CriticalHealthNews.com and PharmacistBen.com or BrightsideBen.com as well. Or you can call the phone team at 866-735-2470, 866-735-2470. And of course, if you're dealing with any of the signs of accelerated aging, dark spots, fine lines and wrinkles, or if you have acne or oily skin, check out my Truth Treatment Retinol gel, 5% retinol gel, effective for zits, acne, oily skin, as well as for wrinkles and dark spots. Retinol is absolutely amazing stuff, but you got to have enough of it. That's why I put 5% retinol in our retinol, Truth Retinol uh, retinol gel. You can find out all about it at truthtreatments.com, truthtreatments.com. All right, I've been getting tons of letters from Dr. Wallach's appearance on George Nori a couple days ago. Letters to uh, Critical Health News, our website, criticalhealthnews.com. I want to go over some of these letters. I think I'll do that. If we don't get calls anyway, I'll do that in our next segment. 844-236-6010 is our number. We do have a full board open for you at 844-236-6010. But I got so many letters. And these letters are just kind of basic information. But it, it really reminds me about how, how we're in big trouble, folks. There are so many people who aren't listening to this program who have no idea of how to take care of their bodies or how their bodies work or what to do about peripheral neuropathy and heart issues and skin issues and erectile dysfunction issues and especially tinnitus and macular degeneration and Alzheimer's disease. It's so tragic. It is so heartbreaking. Folks, nobody, nobody, nobody has to suffer this way. Nobody does. And the medical model is a failure. We have to get this through our heads. When it comes to chronic degenerative disease, there is nothing your doctor can do. Nothing. Nothing. The medical model is not allowed in the body at the level of where a cell breaks down, at the level of a cell. Sure, the medical model can poison a cell with drugs. Sure, the medical model can remove a cell or radiate a cell through surgery or through through toxic radiation. But it cannot help us at the level of a cell where disease begins. It cannot help us at the level of dirty blood, which precedes cell disease. All disease is cell disease, and and all cell disease is dirty blood. But it doesn't matter. And this is so heartbreaking. When I, if you could hear these letters, if you could see these letters that I get or hear these phone calls that I get, it is so tragic and so unnecessary. And I know I get... I'm guilty of beating up on the medical model. I'm guilty of beating up on physicians. But it's not their fault because it's not their job to take care of ourselves, to take care of us at the level at the level of a cell, at the level of a blood, at the level of our peripheral neuropathies and our Alzheimer's disease and our tinnitus and our macular degeneration. So in our next segment, if we don't get calls anyway, in our next segment, I'm going to go over some of these letters. It just breaks my heart. All right. So the connection between the skin and the adrenals, super fascinating. There's two basic hormone types that you have coming out of the adrenal glands. You've got your happy hormones and your sad hormones. I don't want to put it that way, but that's kind of simplistic. But they're your stress hormones, your survival hormones, and your growth and repair and anti-aging hormones. These are two distinct classes of hormones, but, but they are both derived from the same chemical. Yes, our stress hormones come from the same raw material, and our fertility and youth and growth and repair and anti-aging Hormones come from the same material. It's called cholesterol. In fact, cortisol is a type of cholesterol. And estrogen and testosterone are types of cholesterol. And progesterone is a type of cholesterol. And pregnenolone and DHEA are types of cholesterol. In fact, all our steroid hormones that come out of the adrenal glands, they're all cholesterol. They're all types of cholesterol. Just another reason why it's so idiotic to take a drug that shuts down cholesterol. If you shut down your cholesterol, you're going to be shutting down the production of all your steroid hormones, which are types of cholesterol. Tell that to your doctor the next time he wants to put you on a statin drug or tells you to watch your cholesterol levels. Estrogen is virtually cholesterol. For all intents and purposes, if you look at the chemical structure of estrogen, testosterone, progesterone, DHEA, pregnenolone, all the hormones that make our skin beautiful, that fight wrinkles, that build bone, that build muscle, that make us smarter, that support our immune system. They're all types of cholesterol. Now, they're functionally different, certainly. Estrogen